Hey YouTube, so here's the 8 gallon glowfish tank. I've thrown a couple of stems of wisteria in from my tank that I've trimmed off and you can see they're really doing well floating. They're growing tons and tons of roots and in fact if I open the top here you'll see that it's even growing up out of the water and there's not much broom there between the light but it's growing up so we'll see what it does it looks like it's pushing down the rest of the plant it might be trying to root itself I don't know what's going on So as you can see, everything's really healthy in here. I have a little bit of algae on this side, but that's all right because there's a nerite snail in here somewhere. There's a horned nerite snail here. And that thing's been doing a really good job. You can see all those little trails through the algae. That's from the snail eating it. There's a lot of shrimp in here now. I've added from my tank, and then there were babies in here a little while ago. There's, I think, five or six that survived all these big fish in here. I wasn't expecting the shrimp to reproduce so quickly. I was hoping that Java moss would grow up a little bit more so they'd have more shelter, but they don't, so only a couple survived. There's more pregnant females in there, so I'm hoping with this wisteria also they might survive a little bit more. But I'm just really blown away by this wisteria. It's just growing in all directions, floating up. It's really cool. There's always shrimp hanging out in it and eating off of it and things. And the fish seem to enjoy it too. Alright, thanks for watching.